The Legacy Boys tennis team already clinched the top spot in the WDA Regional Tournament. A big part of their success has been the emergence of junior Corby Swahovic. Phil Bonatti has more. A lot of eyes fall on the number one spot on the number one team in the WDA. Right now it belongs to Corby Swahovic, who started the year as the number four singles. A quick rise through the ranks that started in the offseason. I definitely improved on my consistency, keeping the ball over the net, and then just, I don't know, I've gotten stronger, and then playing, just playing over the season, just get, everything gets better when you practice. Svihovic knows he's physically grown since he was a sophomore, and his teammates took notice when they started playing each other throughout the year. I got my butt kicked in the, in the winter by him last year, and I didn't think much of it. I was like, oh, I'm probably sore and I haven't played in two months. And then he came back and got me again and I was like, oh my God. <laughs> Svihovic is eight and four as a singles player this year, but he surprises himself with the ability to stay in matches with the best talent in the state. I've had some pretty close matches with people I thought were just levels above me, so I definitely feel good. As a team, Legacy is undefeated in the WDA. And Svihovic's confidence continues to grow, but he knows it's not just about the physical skills that will make him successful. Not everything being stronger. I mean, not uh, some of the best players aren't the strongest. They just can get the ball over the net. All eyes will be on Legacy and Svihovic, the emergence of an unlikely contender who's ready for his time to shine. In Bismarck, Phil Bonatti, KX Sports. So Hovick and the Legacy Sabres are wrapping up their regular season against Bismarck tonight. The region tournament starts next week.